Welcome back, Warriors, to the channel. I'm Warlog, and today I have an Apex Legends video for you. We're going to be checking out the Stories from the Outlands Promise trailer. All right, guys, for this trailer, we're just going to watch it. You guys are going to see my reaction and my thoughts throughout the trailer and after. So hopefully there's some passion that we can look at after the video. If you guys do enjoy these kind of videos, make sure to drop a like. And if you're new here, be sure to subscribe and join the Warriors so you guys get more Apex Legends videos. And let's jump straight into the trailer. All Man, right, dear. I'll tell you the story but one last time. Once upon a time, a kingdom was in a terrible state, and they needed a hero to save it. Someone brave and true to her word. When this hero said she'd save us all, you knew she'd find a way to do it. Man, Apex is all in on female leads, like big time female characters. It's awesome. And the cinematics in this, like the way it just looks. We'll, we'll get into it. Let's keep watching. But it wasn't he without sacrifice. For the hero, had someone very special in her life. Oh boy. Someone she loved more than anything. And all she wanted was a kingdom safe for him. Oh. But just when it felt like the world was against her, and her sacrifices were all for naught, hope emerged, and there was just one more thing to do. Oh, that girl looked pissed. The hero must travel to faraway land to find the crystals that would save us all. But first, she made a promise. I'll be back, and we'll be together soon. You promised? Oh, no. I'm a love. And although the hero was very scared, this special person made her brave. She gave her word. She would go to the ends of the universe for him and return. It just looks the amazing. Kingdom saved. These faraway lands are deep, dark, uncharted. But, as any hero knows, if there's no risk, no journey into the unknown, then there's no discovery. And with the crystals in hand, and the certainty of a promise kept, all the fear washed away. Brandium transfer complete. Do you have it? Uh-oh. And in the end, well, uh -oh. they lived happily ever after. Sorry, dearie. Oh, you evil bitch! Olympus, bro! about to get Olympus? Oh, she's imagining. And just how is it? They lived happily ever after, I hear you asking. Because, my wee one, this isn't the end of our story. That's a black hole. Seven years later. It's like she hasn't aged a day. Do you promise? Look at her home planet, dude. Don't worry, my boy. I'll keep that promise yet. It's just a matter of time. Whoa! Season seven is on the horizon. Click to read. Holy crap, guys. First of all, we're going to get into this. See, Apex Legends Season 7 Ascension. Olympus wastes in Apex Legends Season 7 Ascension. 
Who will rise to the challenge? No, will you? Holy crap, dude. Okay, hold up. First, let's talk about the cinematics here. Okay, I don't think I've ever played a game, a battle royale, you know, or a shooter, maybe besides COD, I guess, because the franchise is just so long, but that has put this much work into their lore. Like, with every single character, it's all pieced together. Each one has a very interesting background and where they came from. You know, some characters have made more of an impact than others, but that's still okay. Holy crap, man. I think the only other trailer that blew my mind as much as this one did was the Revenant trailer. The Revenant trailer was absolutely amazing. God, that trailer was awesome, dude. I cannot wait for season seven now. All right, we just checked that out. New map, Olympus. I knew it, dude. Olympus is here, man. Ascend to a beautiful, lush city in the clouds. Just watch your step. It's a long way down to the planet below. Now, here's the quick question. This is great. We were expecting this season six. We didn't get it. We got it in season seven. Now, is there going to be a full rotation of the other three or, you know, of all three? Or is it going to just, you know, replace World's Edge or what? You know, who who knows? You know, how are they going to do the splits, you know, for ranked? Are they going to just pick two out of the three or what? You know, they're going to cycle out and just have two maps at a time. Who knows? Those are my dogs barking. All right. And then new legend, Horizon. A brilliant astrophysicist who escapes a black hole and aims to use her newfound mastery of gravity to keep a promise. So she survives the black hole using some form of gravity. Wow, dude. I'm actually kind of curious what kind of ability she's got. Introducing the Trident. Olympus is a big place. Cover the ground faster with the Trident. Plenty of room for the whole squad. Okay, so now we're going into Call of Duty mode. We got, uh, you know, in, in Battlefield, we're going to have vehicles to be able to get around the map a lot faster. It looks like just on Olympus, though, so. Uh, that's going to be a big, that's crazy. That's going to be a big map. I wonder if it, I wonder how much bigger it is than World's Edge. Because World's Edge is bigger than King's Canyon, and World's Edge is actually a pretty solid map. You know, the more I play it, the more I kind of like it. But I still RIP Skulltown. Love you to death. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, Season 7 is coming to Steam for all you PC players. Uh, I play on PC, but all my skins are on console. So until they make that cross-save, I'll still be on console. Um, but this is cool. It's coming to uh, to Steam, which is great. Introducing clubs. Find like-minded players, build a community, and rise together. So this is kind of cool. This is kind of like uh, clans or guilds and WoW, right? You you got clubs, and you can get build a community and all play together. I think that's unique. That's awesome. Of course, we got Battle Pass, guys. Ranked Season 7. Let's take a look at Ranked real quick. Let's see. Let's take a look at Ranked. Season 6 results again. Um, rewards are going to be... Uh, rewards are for competitive players. Um, so this shows that Diamond... and So look at, the, look at the numbers real quick, guys. Look at these numbers. Split two who played more than five hours, okay? Now, every season that I've played, I've made it to Apex, Master, or Diamond, okay? Uh, I was Diamond once, and I was Master or Apex Predator every single season, um, except for one. So, this shows that Diamond and higher, ranked, and higher ranks have returned to the same distribution as Season 4 after seeing a slight inflation during Season 5. You know, a big part of this is because of hackers, but overall, we continue to monitor the distrib distribution of players, but feel this distribution is working additionally the popularity of ranked games continue to grow we're seeing ranked matches taking between 25 percent and 45 percent of all games played depending on the day wow that's kind of crazy so more and more people are playing ranked over pubs that, that i mean that's good to, that's good to know uh rewards dive trails are coming after so as usual previous season will expire but if you miss a chance to earn the season six trail feel or not we plan to let players earn a chance to get it to earn it again in season 10. Holy shit, dude. Uh, ensure competitive con integrity through skill-based matchmaking. I still hate skill-based matchmaking, guys, with a passion. But, you know, it's here. While cons uh, we are still considering changes to RP and matchmaking systems, the, our focus on crossplay this past season means we'll have to wait a bit longer to test out any, few, any new features and ranks. Speaking of crossplay, scroll down a bit and see some answers. Okay. Let top tier player, Apex Legend players compete at the highest level of skill. Master and Apex 
Predator tiers continue to display the most consistency successful players in the world. That's good to know. Thank you. Uh, preview six of ranked rewards. That's nice. Um, cool. You got some more stuff. Uh, split dates. Okay, here we go. So we'll be starting with Olympus, moving to World Edge in the second split. With, with the planned split reset on December 15th, Kings Canyon will sit this season out. Interesting. So Kings Canyon's out. We got World's Edge and Olympus. Awesome. Rank leagues and crossplay. Uh, now that crossplay is launched, console players are opted into opted in crossplay will match make against against all other console players. Everyone's sorted pool as usual. Okay. Um, if you are a PS4 player playing with PC friend, the RPE score toward your rank on PS4, even though they're a PC player. Okay. Final words. We'll continue to look at the crossplay. Crossplay and has rank progression. Interesting. Okay. Um. Okay, that's kind of cool. Um, interesting. Awesome. Okay. So, ranked seems to be the same for the most part, guys. And it looks like that's everything. I mean, we got the Steam stuff. Like, this is great. It's going to be on Steam. That, that'll be awesome. Um, I'm really interested in clubs. I'm really interested in the new Legend, uh, in Trident, and then, of course, the new map, guys. But this trailer was absolutely phenomenal. Um... We're going to just put it on low while I talk about it real quick. This trailer was just absolutely amazing, guys. I'm super blown away at what Respawn has done and is committed to for this game. I'm really surprised by the ranked uh, stats and analysis for how many players are actually playing ranked, which is kind of insane because, um, you know, this this is probably the best Battle Royale out. And I, didn't, I honestly didn't think that many players were playing ranked because of all the sweats and... Um, you know, hackers both on PC and on console with glitches, but, uh, wow. I mean, I'm blown away. This trailer is amazing. I'm looking forward to season seven, guys. I can't wait to pump out some more content for you. So thank you guys so much for tuning into today's video. Let me know down, which down in the comments, what you guys think about this trailer, everything that's coming to season seven. Let me know down in the comments. I'll pin a question mark for you guys. Um, like the video. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure to subscribe and join the Warriors. So you guys don't miss out on more Apex Legends videos in the future. And for me, Warlog, as always, guys, this trailer was dope. Stay gaming. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.